And I want you to look at the images and I want you to see how these young women date, uh, rate, I'm sorry, date, God, rate men versus women. Deli, let's pull up number nine and watch this. This is incredible. Great pictures of people out of 10. All right, so there's this guy first. Oh my God. He's negative one million. Okay. What about this girl? She's a 10. She's pretty. She's, she's a 10 out of 10. All right. What about this girl? I think he's a five. All right. What about this girl? She's a seven. She's a what about this girl? Uh, she's a five. He's a three. Wait, so this guy's a three, but this girl is a ten? Yes. Mm -hmm. She's literally gorgeous. What do you mean? She's majestic. But she's yeah, obese, like... though. Well, she is. She is. I know you're not talking looking like a whole and hummy dumpty. Do you think I'm fat? Yes, you look like it. Oh, baby. Where, where's that fat? Like where's that fat up? I'm not body shaming. Isn't it a fact that she's obese? She's not obese. She's gorgeous. What do you mean? She's literally more gorgeous than really? you. But isn't it a fact that she's obese, though? Yeah, but she's gorgeous. Okay, it doesn't matter if she's over, like, big. She's literally gorgeous. Why are you, like, pointing out the fact that she's fat? Literally, no one cares. I don't care. She's literally gorgeous. Because isn't fat unattractive? They pointing out. No. No? Then why did you rate this fat guy negative 10? Because... Oh my god, just shut the f*** up, you little white... Okay, so do you see... So what's fascinating to me, so many things you see in this. The guy is just cool, calm, and collected. The women are like, there's young girls already. You, you can see the programming starts young, and they're kind of like unhinged, cursing, you know, defensive, whatever. You know how we talk about all the time you can criticize men in, in modern day society? but you can't criticize women. Look at it. You got these obese women, big and fat women, right? And you and they're getting rated, oh, is it eight, a nine, a 10, they're beautiful. You see these guys that they're holding up pictures of and the guys are fit. The guys are, you know, slim. They take care of them. Oh, he's a fine. I don't like, oh, I don't like his hair. Oh, his nose, isn't it a little bit crooked? Every time you got a woman that's, 250 pounds on a good day and it's like oh who cares how dare you say she's obese so do you see the double standard that arises now if you didn't care across the board and you weren't somebody that wasn't into looks and you gave a pretty you know consistent answer across the board fine but these women now are being trained that it's okay to rip on men but goff you can't say anything bad about a woman ever if she's fat you can't say she's fat if she's, you know, whatever, you can't, you can't speak the truth. If she's a five, you can't say she's a five. You've got to say she's a 10, right? But if the guy is like an eight, you got to bump him down to like a six because you get to be extra picky. And plus, don't those guys need their egos wrecked a little bit anyway? That is the messaging from the modern feminist movement. So I wanted you to see it on display in that moment. It's crazy to see it like that, isn't it? And they're so young. You're like, when does this start? Young. It starts in school. It starts in middle school. Okay, I want to know how come women, and there's only women that act this way, when y'all know that y'all overweight and y'all need to lo lose weight, how come y'all get upset if somebody tells you that? How come people have to lie to you? But I thought women say they hate liars. But you want somebody to lie to you. Oh, she's gorgeous. I'm not saying that she's not a gorgeous person. But it's funny, like she said, oh, the woman overweight is a 10, the man is overweight is a 3. Or oh, the first one said, no, a negative 1 million. Good looking guy that's not overweight, that's in good shape, is a, is a 5, it's a 4. Even called the man that's showing you the pictures, Humpty Dumpty. He said, oh, you think I'm fat? Show me what a fat is. But the woman is a 10. And then when you say, okay, why is the woman that's overweight a 10, but the man that's overweight is not a 10? Had no answer, paused for a minute, and then just went straight to insults. Hmm. Couldn't answer the question because you know he got your ass. You see what I'm saying? The, 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 the irony behind all of this is like, dude, just be realistic with people. Don't sit here and lie. You know goddamn well what you really think. And see, the thing is, she's not lying. The feminist movement has sit here and lied to these women. 
The feminist movement have lied to these women. That's the part that I hate, man. It's like, and and, and you and y'all going towards these little bitty kids, poisoning in their mind, and, and, and you have really no real explanation on why. It's like to me, I don't. Okay, put it like this here. She could be a gorgeous person even if she is overweight. He can be an ugly person if he, even if he is fit. But the point is, you only rated that woman a 10 because she's a woman. Because she's a woman. She's majestic. What do you mean she's gorgeous? Well, well give a solid reason on why you did that. You can't. And this lady right here is not lying. This lady right here is not lying. You only attacking the feminist movement, excuse me, is it's starting off with young kids. You know damn well being overweight is not a good thing. Everybody knows that. That's why people, even big people that, that body positivity crap, even they try to lose weight. Oh, that's fat shaming. If you go and try to lose weight, that's fat shaming. Look here. I don't give a fuck what no one says. I am a human being. I know my what my body, how much weight my body can take to have a good quality of life. I know. I've seen plenty of videos. I have gotten plenty of videos of women that are overweight that can't live a good quality of life and then want to blame it on something else. Oh, I can show you what I'm talking about because I got plenty of them. I've been working on it. I don't know when I might release that, that video, but I got plenty of them I'm planning on putting together. It's like, really? Matter of fact, I've done some myself. It's like, oh, is this woman, uh, 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 you know, I'm just going to put it like this here. I'm not talking about anybody's weight on a negative way. I'm talking about, I'm talking about people's weight in this video, having a good quality of life and the contradictedness that these kids have shown because their mind is already poisoned by feminist movement. No matter what. You uplift that girl. No matter what, she's gorgeous. You let her know that she can conquer the world. No matter what. But if it's a man that's handling his business, doing his thing, uh-uh, no, that ain't right. Uh-uh, he, he know damn well. He don't know what he doing. It's like, wait a minute. I thought, you know, what? Huh? What? Who told you? What? Why? Damn. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's like, it's cool on one side, but not the other. And then you can't even give it an answer on why. It's, that's always women's mindset. is to get angry, it's to attack, it's to insult. That's always the female mindset. You can't sit back and say, look, this is what I think. Oh, I think this because of this and that, blah, blah, blah. You see what I'm saying? Women can't do that. They have to always be in defensive mode. And it's like you have no reason to be. I don't, I, it's like, what? It'd be different if you was always under attack, but, but you're not. Y'all think y'all are. He just, the man just started off saying, what do you rate this guy? What do you rate this girl? What do you rate this guy? What do you rate this girl? They said, wait a minute. Why would you give this girl a, a, a 10, this overweight girl a 10, but this overweight guy a 3? It's because she's a female. Let's just be real and be honest. Because she's a female. <laughs> 
Oh my goodness. My point of this video, because I know I'm rambling, my point of this video is this. Y'all see what the feminist movement is doing. This lady is not lying. Y'all see what the feminist movement is doing. Poisoning these young girls' mind already. These kids. Poisoning their mind. Mm, mm, mm. Hey, this is what, how I see this. They're going to have to live with their decisions when they get older. They're going to have to flip that script when they get older. They're going to wish they wasn't like this when they get older. That's all I got to say.